get ready to trunk or treat. Yes, it's RPV's annual trunk or treat celebration right here at the Kendida Civic Center where all our favorite ghosts and goblins and characters come together at Halloween time. I'm Emily Rodine with the Recreation and Parks Department and we're at one of my favorite events, Trunk or Treat. We have a lot of fun activities going on. We got the bouncies for the kids to jump around all day and have a great time. We got the Recreation and Parks booth with some free giveaways. We got free face painting and a puppet show going on at later on in this afternoon and a lot more fun to be had. So Trunk or Tree, what actually takes place is that we get volunteers and businesses from the community to come out and host a decorated car trunk. You'll go around and see about, there's probably 16 trunks today. They have free giveaways and goodies for the kids to grab. Oh, this is so fun. We come every year. I'm a kitty cat, although my kids think I look like a skunk. So I'm offended. Are you gonna, are you a, an amazing pumpkin today? Yeah. yeah. Can you say happy Halloween? Happy Halloween. <laughs> what are you looking forward to doing when you get here? I think the bounce houses and the candy. All right, ready? Here we are. We're with our favorite trunk or treaters at the Reach Trunk. And this year we got a little uh, Hawaiian magic going. Are you having a good time? Yes. <laughs> what do you love? You come here every year. I just like seeing all the kids in their costumes. Like People watching is my favorite thing. <laughs> and what do you love about the Reach program? Just like um, going out and doing new things. <laughs> I see my neighbor over here. Can we uh, get a big aloha from you? Aloha. Are you having a good time as always? Yeah. Hey there, my name is Angela. I'm the rec specialist with the REACH program. We're having a great time here at Trunk or Treat. The REACH program serves adults with developmental disabilities in the South Bay area. We do excursions. We have lots of great recreational opportunities. And today we are enjoying some fun with the community. We're here handing out candy. We have a Hawaiian theme going on for our trunk. So of course we had to have some Hawaiian barbecue as well. Our participants love to be with the community, become integrated and just be members of the community and we really look forward to meeting you soon and we hope to see you down here. Welcome to the Trunk or Treat event of October 2024. We are so happy to be here again this year. Our team this year is Wizard of Oz and the Witch is a Wizard of Oz. This is Glenda and I'm Wicked Witch of the West and this is our trunk. We are so happy to be here with so many wonderful little kids. And we are hoping to be here again next year. Thank you so much, everybody. I am Glenda, and I have a ginormous crown with pink um, stars on it, and I'm just really happy to be here. Hi, my name is Lisa Wellstead from the City of Rancho Palos Verdes Parks and Recreation team. I'm here at our trunk or treat. We have wonderful trunks this year, and we're gonna take you on a little tour, starting with our trunk. Brought to you by the Lion's Heart Group. We have a luau. We've got some palm trees, some leaves, a little Hawaiian vibe going on. And then they did two trunks for us today. So we're going to come right next door to our Cookie Monster truck. And it looks like we have Elmo with us too. Will you tell us a little, a little bit about your group that you're here with today? Um, my, my, my group is like, so we go and we do volunteer things around the around our community just to help out so the community is a better place for people like people like everyone here. We're here at a little bit of a spookier trunk um, brought to us by Black Knight. Thank you for being here. How are you enjoying Trunk or Treat? It's going well, you know, there's a lot of kids coming up. They all like our decorations, you know, we got the dog, the skeleton, giving out a mix of candy, everyone's having a good time. The kids are having fun. Some of them are dressed up, just kind of like us, so we take pictures with them. You know, it's a good good thing to do with the community. Can you tell us about Black Knight? So Black Knight's a private security company based out of San Pedro. We service all and any partners, private, public. Uh, we service Rancho Paul's where it is. You know, we work for pretty much anybody. All right, so here's another great story. It's Toy Story, and I have to say, this is the trunk that my family decorated. It's our first time participating like this, and we are having a rootin' tootin' time. I'm here as Jesse the Cowgirl. My son over there, well, he is Woody. Howdy, Woody. Howdy, partner. Thank you so much for being here today. How are you enjoying Trunk or Treat so far? We're having a rude and tootin' good time here at Trunk or Treat. It's so fun, all the kids are dressed up and it's a real barnyard over here. Can you tell us a little bit about your trunk? I see maybe you've got some of Andy's toys with you today. 
Andy was lucky enough to borrow some toys for the day. We've got uh, Woody in the car, we got Buzz, got some Mickey as well, and a lot of balloons just to make the trunk all that more special. Have you seen any other little Woodies today or little Jessies running around? There's a lot of little ones, but the most important is my sidekick, Jessie, who helped put this whole thing together with me. That's right, you're here with your mom, who happens to be behind camera right now, and she's dressed as Jessie, so you guys really do complete the, the set. The whole gang's here. The whole gang's here. I found a couple trunk or treaters here, and we thought we'd just ask them about how the day's going. How are you going, and what's, how's it going, and what's your name? Hudson, it is going good. And what costume are you wearing today, Hudson? I'm wearing an alien that's carrying someone. Well, it's me. What's your favorite part about trunk or treats? <laughs> the show. The show. We have Lisa from Kittle Crew here, and she just did a great puppet show for everyone. She's also doing some games, and I think in about an hour she's going to be doing a mummy wrapping contest, which is a crowd favorite. <laughs> My name is Melinda. We're with School of Rock Palos Verdes. Um, we're a music school for ages three to adult. We teach guitar, bass, drums, keys, and vocals. And this season we're doing totally 80s. So every group is doing all the different genres within that super awesome decade of rock music. Um, how have you have you found Trunk or Treat so far? Are you enjoying yourself? It's been super great. I'm really impressed with the turnout. Um, so many great kids and families. It's great to be a part of this community. Thank you so much again for joining us today. All right, we are here with a Nightmare Before Christmas themed trunk. Can you tell us? A oh, and you have Zero with you. Hey, Zero with us. Yes, Zero is keeping us company today as we are passing out candy and giving prizes away for our Nightmare Before Christmas theme. Thank you so much for being here and participating. I know we've seen you before, so this oh, yeah. is not your first time. Um, what brings you to Trunk or Treat? Uh, well, we just love supporting the community, and especially we're a part of the community. Um, I'm with House of Winters. We're a real estate company here. We do residential sales and property management, all things real estate. And my colleague here is actually an attorney who does real estate attorney, trust, uh, family law, and civil litigation. So we kind of cover everything to help our community out with whatever they need. Uh, well, my name is Brent, and I own a karate school up in the PV Mall called American Legacy Karate Academy. And we're here just handing out some candy and making some friends. Awesome. Thank you so much for being here. Have you? What's your favorite costume you've seen? Uh, I like the little baby Snoopy. Oh, cute, cute. Yeah, there's some good costumes here today. I am here with a Nightmare Before Christmas trunk. Thank you so much for being here. How are you enjoying Trunk or Treat so far? Oh, we're having a blast. This is a fantastic event. Great, and you're here from Fit for Mom. Can you tell us a little bit about Fit for Mom? Absolutely. We are a mom and child workout group that meets in local parks and gets in a one-hour workout that entertains your children and also gets you moving. We also have mama-only classes where you can come without your kids and get a nice, intense workout in. Can you tell us um, a favorite costume you've seen so far today at Trunk or Treat? Oh my gosh, there's been so, so many costumes. I can't get over it. There's been some cute uniforms. There's been lots of Jack Skellingtons. There's been witches and ghosts. It's too many to choose. I'm Audrey Smith. I work for Recreation and Parks. I'm a recreation specialist at PBIC, which is Port the Point Vicente Interpretive Center. Um, at this booth, we have a game for the children. If they get a one or three, they choose from one bucket. A five, they choose from a little bit larger prize. Happy Halloween, everybody. You're going batty here. I like your necklace. What do you enjoy most about coming here? I just enjoy seeing the kids having a great time, dancing, and the crafts are just, it's fun to see how they turn out. I am here at a special karaoke trunk with the Creative Factory. Thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you for having us. We're very excited to be here. It's a great event. Thank you. Can you tell us a little bit more about the Creative Factory? Yes, of course. We're a music and acting school and we create all of our own original songs, original plays, where the kids are the creators, so you're just free to be your truest self. So come on down, get your first free acting lesson, music lesson, singing lesson, and we're adding dance also. Wow, that sounds great. Yeah. Uh, what's been your favorite part of Trunk or Treat or maybe a favorite costume that you've seen? You know, I really like the puppet show. That was fantastic. And there was a beautiful witch with this long, long black cloak, and she was absolutely gorgeous. Yes. And who do we have here? 
Hello? <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna unmask it. No, these are twins, Harry and Oliver. Wow, nice to meet you. Are you guys enjoying Trunk or Treat? Uh, yeah, we're enjoying it. It's really fun just to see all the costumes and scaring people. <laughs> this guy's scaring all the little kids. You guys are doing a good job passing out candy and scaring everybody that comes up yeah. to your booth, huh? Yeah. Well, again, thank you so much for joining us. Yeah. I am here with a family of unicorns. Thank you so much for joining us this year at our Trunk or Tree. Yeah. Our pleasure. Thank you for having us. And you have a special connection to the city of Rancho Palos Verdes. Will you tell a little, tell us a little bit more about how you ended up here today? Oh, sure. I am a senior planner with the city and the community development department. And um, hi, Skeleton. And I've worked here for about 16 years. Amazing. We really appreciate you coming to support. And tell us a little bit about your costume. So I have, uh, well, this is my friend Dixon. And uh, he and I go everywhere whether I like it or not. Um, he's a good friend and um, he's magical and he, he decides when he should appear for people and today he decided it was a good day. Wow, we are so lucky that we have him here today. Um, what's the, what's the, your most favorite costume you've seen so far today? Favorite costume, I would say, that's a good one. There was somebody dressed as like a full T-Rex outfit before. Yeah, I didn't, I'm not sure where he went. Maybe he went back to extinction, I'm not sure, but uh, really enjoyed that one. All right, well, we're hanging out with our Trunk or Treat T-Rex and family from RPV. Are you having a good time? We are having a great time. I know you said you're the auntie. You're the best auntie to bring them here. What are you loving about this event? Thank you. This is so much fun. It's an amazing way to just get the community together and for the kids to come out and play. Um, so they're having a great time. And uh, what's it like uh, charging around as a dinosaur? Um, hot. <laughs> are you having fun? Are you having fun? Can you say, can I see what's in your, did you get a lot of treats? Do you love this? Can you say happy Halloween? Happy Halloween. Happy Halloween. All right, as we wrap it up here at Trunk or Treat, I have to say yeehaw, and we hope you had a spooktacular time. That'll do it right here at the Kendida Civic Center. And remember, we are RPV together.